I did for saying no when my family said I should let my sister have her honeymoon at my house. Backstory. My house used to belong to my parents, but they sold it to me in 2017. It had been a family vacation home of sorts. Every couple years when my grandparents were alive they'd invite us kids up there for a week. Fast forward to the end of 2016. My sister got accepted to her dream college. Won't say which but it's a big one. Everyone was excited and proud of her, me too. But a week after that my parents called asking if I'd found a house yet. I was looking for one and my family knew it. I'd been saving up since I started my first job at 20. I said no, so my dad suggested I buy the lake house from them. I asked why they wanted to sell it. Turns out sis didn't have any savings for college and didn't get some scholarship like she planned. And our parents couldn't afford to pay for everything either. I asked why she didn't get student loans and they said they didn't want her ruining her credit. So their solution was to sell the lake house and use the money from that to finance her college. I had lots of good memories from the lake house, so eventually I agreed. I work at a computer so after getting a good internet connection out there I moved right in and been there since. My GF moved in permanently last year before lockdown and it's been pretty blissful. 2019 my sister and her college BF got engaged. Parents agreed to pay for her wedding. But like with every other wedding around then things got set back. Sis had to postpone her wedding until this year. She plans to have it in December. I even agreed to be in the bridal party. Issues came up recently when my sis asked where I was going to stay for the two weeks after her wedding. Puzzled I answered my house. She got a sour look and said that wouldn't work, her and fiancé would be there, and they wanted private time. I asked why they'd be at my house, and she said that's where they were having their honeymoon. Two weeks alone at a lake house. I said that was news to me. She insisted our parents said it was fine. But I said it wasn't their place to make decisions about my house. After arguing she called our parents who said I was being unreasonable. I said I didn't want my sister and her fiancé christening their new union by fucking in my house. They said I was being gross and selfish. I said no again so sis threatened to remove me from the bridal party. I just shrugged and said okay. She starts crying, saying she already couldn't have her dream wedding like she wanted, and now I was trying to ruin her honeymoon too. I told her to rent a hotel room like every other newlywed couple then hung up. She's not speaking to me and I'm uninvited to the wedding. Our parents keep calling me and saying I should do this for her, since her wedding is only one third what she wanted it to be. But I'm not comfortable with them staying unsupervised at my house. They're making me feel like a monster for saying no. Ida. Edit. Well ah, uh, learned something new today. I spoke to my sister like a few people suggested and asked her if she knew the lake house was legally my house. As in, I bought it years ago. She was not in fact aware of this. She was under the impression from her parents that they were letting me live there rent free, I corrected her, and even showed her proof that they sold the house to me. And when she asked why they sold it, I was honest and said it was to pay for her college tuition lifestyle. She became quiet after that and we soon hung up. No idea what's going to happen now.